Good Morning Golf High. I'm Elizabeth. And I'm Mr. Rutherford, coming to you from WBUC Studios with your school news. The word of the day today is gasconade, which is a noun meaning confident talker behavior that is intended to impress other people. Can you use that in a sentence, Mr. Rutherford? I sure can, Elizabeth. After all of his gasconade, the contestant couldn't manage to complete the obstacle. For lunch today, we will be having PB&J, chopped chicken salad, and Big Daddy's Pizza. And remember, breakfast and lunch is free every day. And now for today's weather forecasts. We're drying up a bit going into our three-day weekend with a high today of 88 degrees and a 50% chance of afternoon showers. Enjoy the extended weekend and have a great day, Bucks. In 1783, the Treaty of Paris is signed, which officially ends the American Revolution. In 1777, the Stars and Stripes flag flies for the first time in battle. And in 1861, Confederate forces enter Kentucky. In current news, the movie Top Gun sequel release has been delayed again until May of 2022. Skeleton of world's largest triceratops could fetch $1.4 million at auction. New Jersey ballpark underwater due to flooding from Hurricane Ida. 1920s gangster Al Capone, South Florida home to be demolished.
here's the joke of the day. What do dentists call their x-rays? Stay tuned to the end of the news for the answer. There will be an interest meeting for girls and boys soccer on Tuesday, September 7th. For questions, please see Mr. Lopez in room 255. So, what do dentists call their x-rays? Toothpicks. That's all for our news. Have, Have a, a great, great National Bowling, Bowling League, League Day, Golf, Golf High. High. It's all right, he's going to use the dead wood. We'll use the dead wood. <laughs> Curve. Yeah. That one's pretty good. Next, a Vera Papa Pipparoo, in which Handy Andy adds some fancy footwork just to make things more complicated. Two more balls rolled by hand will cross each other's path. Well, let's see. That's it. Good going, guy. <laughs>